Hello gamers, uh, Pet here. Welcome to a first look at a game called 868 Hack or 868 Hack or whatever you want to call it. It's a puzzle game that first came out on uh, iPads like one or two years ago and it finally came out on Steam and I'm a bit excited because I like playing games like this on Steam because it's kind of a, it's a fast game and sometimes I like, you know, cooking in the kitchen. I come back here, I play a couple of games and I go back and stir the soup or something like that. Anyway, it's, a, it's an interesting game. So let's actually just dive into it. So I'm just, I just started the game. I am the one that's controlling the face. Basically, I'm controlling the face. And what I have to do is try to advance as many stages as possible, right? Whenever I move, the enemy will move if the enemy will be there. Uh, there is an enemy spawning right now on the top the right corner, right? You see that square there. Not the green square. That's the door that's leaving me to the next uh, sector. But it's there, you see? I move. And he uh, he went into a mob right now, into a monster, right? And there are various monsters. Some can walk through those big screens, big squares that have one, two, four, three, and so on. Uh, which is, in this case, is this mob monster. Some are more resilient, some uh, move only one square, some are invisible and only b become visible when they are in range and so on. So basically, as I've said, I have to advance to the sectors and I have not, I, I don't, I, sh I, I need to be alive basically to advance, right? So basically, uh, this is what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to go there. I took the data symphony. Data symphony is basically something that you, you, you will see what it does. But now I'm a little bit in a tricky position. Oh no, it's okay. You see, he, he he's next to me. He can hit me basically. But if I press up into his direction, bam, bam, and I killed him. And now I'm moving on. Alright, I'm moving on. A new monster spawned. I'm moving on. I know that he's on the top right. So... If I go up, he will hit me. So I will just go down. Bam, he moved into my view. Bam, bam, I killed him. Easy as that, right? I took the other data symphony. And now basically, you see, there are dollars and there are these blue screens, right? The energy, basically. Um, in order to survive, I'm basically using programs. Uh, right now, I only have one program called Step. Uh, if I activate a data sign from here and I'm going to do that now you see I do a plus around me and I'm basically taking all those squares I gain the I gain the dollars I gain the energy but because the left square had a four on it it spawned four monsters so now I need to survive them basically so I'm going to move up hit hit shit this is bad I'm going to go back Okay, I got one hit. I, I, I believe I can get maximum of three hits after that I'm dead. Hit, hit. Whew! Okay, I'm going to survive it, I think. Hit, hit. Hit. Shit. Shit, I'm going to die. Yes. <laughs> okay. Going to start a new game and I'm going to do this faster. Okay, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm still looking at the map and see what I can take. I, it's not... I'm not obliged to do this, but let's actually do it. I'm going to activate the data symphony here and get the weight program. It spawned two monsters. Uh, I'm going to get hit. Okay. That's the least I can do. Okay, let's move to the next area. You see, bam, new map. New monsters. I'm going to take the data symphon or symphon or whatever it's pronounced. Now, what program I want is basically called reset, which is not available yet. The reset program basically costs four energy and can give me health back. Now, I'm not going to go directly to the next level because I'm going to the monster that is currently active is going to go to the next level with me so it's not like a reset level so let's just go there okay oh this is the program reset I'm going to activate it I got the reset but I don't oh actually I have energy to use it oh shit uh, 
Okay, if I use the program and I press 3, I spend 4 energy and I basically healed myself. There are other programs that are going to explode, like the antivirus or the bomb something. And I will show you in the menu a list with all the programs that exist. Let's... Ah! That, that one is a bit... It's a bit nasty because it moves like three squares. <laughs> okay, it's, it's okay. Let's move to the next one. Shit. I'm going to die. Reset. God damn it! <laughs> Let's... It's a bit hard to concentrate and play at the same time. So basic... <laughs> and as I've said, I, I made it close to level 8 to finish this first sector. Uh, I mean to sector 8 to finish this first segment, I think. Uh, but the, at first I was dying on the first or the second level. But then I got better and better and better and I kind of get... It's very important on how you uh, position yourself on the map because monster cannot go into it themselves so if you go into a corner you will be kind of safe basically unless there is that monster that goes through the programs right to, to the squares so these are the programs that i currently unlocked wait increment time step basically whenever i move they move but sometimes me moving it's a bad choice because it it might put me in a bad position <coughs> the germans actually have a word for that but i forgot i forgot it show uh, show hidden files, push, increment enemy one distance, it, it, it will basically push the enemy one distance away from me. Antivirus, attack all viruses. Uh, step, take one step freely. Basically I will be able to move without them moving, again which will allow me to po position myself into a better uh, position. So it's, it's a fast game, let's actually play about... Ah, <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> Uh, that was stupid. Let's do this. A lot of them... Yeah, I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> that was fast. Another one. So you kind of, you know... I think you kind of got the idea what this game is. <laughs> but uh, honestly, it's pretty fun. That's why I actually decided to make a video with it. As I've said, I, I, every time I'm cooking or I'm waiting for a call or something and I can't, you know, play those games that are immersing myself, I'm basically getting into this game and I try to survive. And I try to survive. Oh, I'm going to use an antivirus. A reset. Oh, I kind of don't have points anymore okay I need s some energy so in order to take energy as I've said I'm going to repeat myself now I need to but I can't I, I will do this bam 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 and I took all the stuff in the squares around me I'm going to kill that monster taking that siphon and going to move uh, to the next Sector. Ah, uh, it's pretty annoying when you take hits. Okay, going to take some energy. So basically, check this out. Pop, pop, pop. Energy. He moved. Going to take that siphon. I kind of don't need another program right now. I think. So let's just move. I don't. Mm. Reset. You see, he had an extra move, so he managed to do a hit. Wait might be a useful program. Two monsters spawned. It's not really that bad. Uh, no. Okay. I'm going to take this one. Three monsters will spawn. Ah! Use this and use an antivirus. Ooh, nah, you see? Okay, I have wait. If I move right now to do uh, to do something, he will hit me. Wait, he moved. Okay, so that's how this game is being played. Mm. 
Move. <laughs> I'm a bit, I'm a bit like more of them are spawning. I took a big risk now. I took a big risk. Okay, I have reset. Use an antivirus. Okay, move to the next level. <laughs> that was stupid. Stupid position for me. Wait. I forgot. I forgot that I was almost dead. Anyway, this is 868 Hack, a small and cute puzzle. Uh, puzzle game with cute uh, mechanics. I like the. I, have, I like this program thing and I'm really curious what's going to happen when I will finally finish that sector. You see, there are leather boards, uh, high scores, uh, streak scores, and basically this is me, 8 in 1 run. That's kind of the best thing I ever did. So I'm not really that good. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. Hopefully this was an interesting game for you. Uh, I think the price is about 5 euros or something like that, so try it out. Uh, it's also available on an iPad, so see you soon, goodbye.